On this special day, which was the 167th birthday of the old master, one of his works, Spring Garden, in the Singer Museum, was stolen. Therefore, as a fan after Cloud of Money, I wanted to write about the paintings of Vincent van Gogh, who, as a painter, expressed himself with his art and was never fully understood, apart from his brother. Wheatfield with Crows is my favorite painting of Van Gogh's. We can understand from the intonations of his painting that his depressive side reached the highest. The crows started to flay, and that fine path might have drawn his own final path. Who knows? This painting is on display in the Van Gogh Museum and is probably the last painting he had made before his death. Vincent van Gogh's another well-known painting is Starry Night Over the Rhone. It has a night view of the beach a few minutes from the yellow house where he stayed in Arles. The painting, which evokes the feeling that it is one of the most beautiful nights of September, is on display at the Musée d'Orsay. He described it as yellow and deep blue at night. The stars are like golden goats glowing in the dark. Winston Van Gogh had a special interest not only in wheat fields, but also in cypresses. It is thought that he was trying to catch the eternity and peace with the cypresses reaching the sky. Van Gogh, who saw and reflected the world differently from us, painted the most beautiful cypress in his painting, Green Wheat Field with Cypress. One of the most confusing pictures he created is Prisoner's Round. The most important reason for this is that that painting was inspired by Gustave Doré. Van Gogh did it when he was in the lunatic asylum, and it is said that Van Gogh managed to calm his illness by drawing. Van Gogh's admiration for Monet has always been ignored. However, like Monet's gardens, Van Gogh also had many gardens. Both painters are considered to be impressionists, but in my opinion, the idea that Van Gogh belongs to a movement should be discussed.